In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the power cleaning of your Epson EcoTank ET2800 printer. You can do this if you have a problem with the printing. For example, if your printer is just printing the blank pages and if you are not getting any ink on the sheet. And the another thing is like if your print head is clogged and you have tried doing the automatic print head cleaning. You should try automatic print head cleaning at least three times and if the print quality is not improving then you can do the manual print head cleaning. Even if that is difficult you don't have enough time then you can do the power cleaning. The only drawback with the power cleaning is like it will drain a lot of ink from the printer. We can see this printer has the ink tank at the maximum level so it's almost full. Now you should have at least one third ink left in the printer only then you can do the power cleaning. Right now we can see it's on the top. So these are the markings you can see the black has little bit up to here whereas the color inks are almost full. So once we finish the power cleaning you can see the difference how much ink is used. All the ink will be dumped into the maintenance box that's at the back side of the printer. Now go to the printer display panel, scroll ahead and look for the settings, maintenance, scroll ahead and look for the power cleaning option, press ok. It will give you the print head cleaning information like it will improve the print quality, it will drain the ink. So once you are ready press ok to proceed. So it will give some description like power cleaning allows you to replace all the ink inside the tubes. Low ink levels during power cleaning could damage the printer. So make sure you have enough ink. And it says at least 30% of the ink tank should be there. That means it will take less than 30% but it should be there at least. And press OK to agree with the terms and conditions. Again. The print quality issue should be resolved within 12 hours. That means after performing the power cleaning, it will take at least 12 hours to improve the print quality. You should not be repeating it before 12 hours. So press OK to agree. And that's the last option. Ink inside the tubes will be deposited to the maintenance box. Click on the agree. Press and hold the start button. That's here for 5 seconds to start the power clean. It's going to take around 11 minutes for the power cleaning and we just have to wait for that. Power cleaning is completed and it will take around 12 hours for the print quality to improve. So press OK. Let's do a copy. So we will check the print quality right now. So that will give an idea if all the colors are working here or not. So place it here. And after printing I will also show you how much ink is used in this process. So let's confirm and do the copy. So I am going to do the color copy right now. We can clearly see some of the ink has started to work whereas the ink on this side that is for the magenta is not working. Even for the black it's not that much clear because other colors are mixing and doing the black color here. That means we still have to wait for at least 12 hours. We can see the print head has started to work and we can do our printing. But it will take at least 12 hours for all the inks to show up and work. In case this doesn't work, then you have to do the manual print head cleaning. For that you can watch my video how to do the manual print head cleaning. If we look at the ink tank, we can clearly see it has used a lot of black ink and also the color ink is used. That means this process wastes a lot of ink and to avoid this you can do the manual print head cleaning. Otherwise it will drain a lot of ink. 